Another important feature in the inventory menu is inventory search. Let's say uh, you've forgotten the item number or item ID that you're accustomed to manually type in when you sell a certain item. Let's say this is for an item that you don't have a button for and that you don't scan with a barcode scanner. And if you've forgotten such an item number or item ID, uh, you can go ahead and use this feature to quickly look it up. Um, you can put uh, any word or even a partial word um, in, in, into this item description search box in here and this feature will do a complete search on your inventory against the item descriptions that you have in inventory. Um, let's say we're talking about uh, something that we've put in here in the past in these video tutorials. Let's say our water bottle that we put in here. Um, we're going to search for that and let's put a just like a partial word for water just so you see how it can work with even a partial word. As soon as I click submit in here, it should find it. And there it is. Uh, now, another interesting thing about this feature is, you know, many times some businesses have items that are long discontinued and not used or currently out of stock, you know, but they're still in inventory for just, uh, you know, correct record and all that. And if you don't want to be bothered with such results, you can just click this box in here, this option is for it to search only items that are currently in stock. And that's how we'll just do a search out of only items that are in stock right now. And now when you, once you find the item that you were interested in, if you want to sell this item, and the item number item ID is not something very easy to remember, you can just click on it. And as soon as you click on it, it goes into the clipboard and what that means now we can just paste it anywhere and if you want to sell it we can paste it in here right click and paste or the standard command for pasting through keyword control V and you can sell this item now